What's up? Now, as some of you know, <laughs> the 2016 Olympics will not be held in Chicago, and I blame one person. Kanye. Douchebag! <laughs> that's, you don't, that's not nice. You don't call that man that. That, that dude there is wild. Now, I know it's early, but <laughs> I need you guys to help me crown douchebag of the year douchebag 2000 it's early but we have so many strong front runners john goslin and kanye west they're like the tippy top front runners it's so freak leave a comment and tell me who should be douchebag of 2009 either kanye west or john goslin rate this video five stars and leave a comment who should be douchebag of the year because let me tell you something some people never learn like the time I tried to apply for a job at David Letterman. So, uh, why should I hire you? Well, Mr. Letterman, for two years I worked at The Chappelle Show, <laughs> season two, as a co-writer. And then I did a little stint over at Saturday Night Live as a co-writer and some side acting. And for the last two years I've been working for The Daily Show and doing some assistant writing for The Jimmy Kimmel Show. Miss Johnson, that's a very sexy name. Thank you. Uh, why should I hire you? Uh... Let me see. For the last six months, I've been working on the Bunny Ranch in Nevada. You're hired. Uh, what yes. the? I don't. I don't believe this. Now the long-awaited Lady Gaga slash Gaga Pickle Kanye West tour has been canceled. Hold up. Let me say this before I say that. The one that Fifty Cent Fitty called the Gay Tour. Fifty Cent. <clears throat> Number one. You're saying this, the gay tool, you're lightly using a term that is offensive to a people who, in fact, just live their lives the way they choose to live their lives. That's offensive, man. You're talking about a people who are berated, some are even killed for living, for choosing to live their lives the way they choose to live their lives. So, it's not an easy thing for you just to say the gay tour. It's offensive, dog. You need to be more progressive. Kanye and 50, man. Y'all need publicists. Call me. Hire me. Y'all just yip yapping at the freaking mouth. People flipping on Ye because he tripped on Taylor Swift. Everybody in their mall. The roaches in my house could say whatever they want about Kanye except for you. You know why? Because this is the man that you stood in front of and told the world if he beats me in album sales, I'll quit rapping. So Kanye West, say what you want about him, fam. 50. Kanye West is a constant reminder, 50 Cent, that you are a motherfucking liar. Bottom line. And that's real. Because you still rapping. Kanye West, man, he admitted on the Jay Leno show that he's still hurting behind his mom. He says, I need to go ahead and sit down for a minute and take some time to heal. I feel that. So what does he do? He continues his tour with Lady Gaga, Gaga Pickle. <laughs> Sales are so sad that both groups, Lady Gaga and Kanye, say, you know what, let's not do the tour. Your fans said, you know what, let's go ahead and help this man out. Translation, you're a douchebag. We're not going to see you. Next thing you know, you know, you'll be tripping because Lady Gaga is wearing his underwear and he wants to wear her panties or something. Dude was at Common's charity benefit recently. And trip because there wasn't no chicken. He thought all the chicken had ran out. He was acting like those people in Rochester, New York. You motherfuckers ain't got shit, punk ass motherfucking franchise. Only when it comes to black folks, y'all pull that bullshit. Need your fucking franchise card revoked, punk ass bitch. Look at you, girl. You're so big, you can't even squeak when you walk with your big fat ass. <laughs>